Hey, what's up guys? Johnny here back with another Call of Duty Mobile video. In today's video, all the tips and tricks and all the shortcuts to get the new ruin skin fast and easy, guys. I did it all in one go yesterday on stream. It took me exactly three hours from start to finish, but I was streaming, so chit chat here and there, wasting a little time. I did a few fails also. So let's go into the details, guys. I will show you the steps one by one, all the challenges and how I did it. So you guys can do it fast and let's go, guys. And before we start, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel right now for daily cut mobile videos. All right, so make sure you go on seasonal challenges first because it's where you have to go. And the set of challenges is called Dine and Dash, guys. Dine and Dash to unlock the ruin tangled web and it's actually a super cool skin guys they keep giving us free skins lately so let's just take everything before it's gone and you guys got less than 20 days to do it you can do it in one day but just get started now guys all right so first is uh it says explore and survive to triumph over your enemies in battle royale so you know it's gonna be some battle royale challenges guys and the first one is play five battle royale matches and my tip guys is I did exactly the same I did last time. Why it took me just three hours to do everything is because I didn't play the whole five games. If you want to just do it fast and you don't care about your rank or your points and XP, well, just land in the water and let yourself die. Or you can go on a hot drop and just let someone kill you. It would be faster if you find some people. But I didn't want to take a chance. Just went straight to the water guys. So five quick games, about five to ten minutes max, because there's the waiting time in the lobby and all that. Uh, it takes at least a minute before the game starts and all that. Anyways, five quick games, guys. You don't have to play, but you cannot quit. You have to actually die. And you will lose points five times 20 plus, okay? 100 points plus. I even lost 30 points on my first game at Master 2 and 20 something a little later. So you might de-rank here. But once again, if you don't care, it's not too hard to get your points back in BR. So just do it fast if you need to. Then the next one, you have to actually play a game. You have to enter the top 10 once in Battle Royale. Well, top 10 teams, if you play uh, solo, it's top 10 players. But if you play in squads, top 10 teams is not too bad. Like uh, after a few minutes, there's like 50 players left. It's almost half the field already. So just play, just play a normal game and you're probably going to finish in the top 10 anyways. You don't have to win, but finish the game. Top 10 teams if you play in squads, all right? All right, next one could be tricky if you play in squads. So I decided to do that one solo. Airdrops, guys, you need to be the first on the airdrop and be the one that actually open it. I did it all five in one game. There's more than five airdrops. There's actually five before the tanks, I think. And after the tanks, there's going to be a few more. So there's plenty, but you have to be there first. So what I do is right off the bat, I land where I know I can find a chopper. I will go straight to a chopper. You can go kill house if you want. I did uh, get screwed there. Uh, but yeah, countdown and stuff like that. Uh, the docks, um, Nuketown and uh, piers. Like the, air, the, the helicopters location are pretty much the same as before. And the new location have tons of choppers also. So if you know where to find one, just go straight for it. And then maybe loot a little bit, but then go up in the sky. Uh, when the first safe zone is gonna start shrinking, uh, you are gonna hear uh, airdrop is coming. As soon as you know the airdrop is coming, look at your mini map and you should see a, a, a green plane. Go there, man, and follow the plane. Be the first when the airplane is gonna drop the airdrop. Well, look in the sky. You're going to see where it is. Make sure you get there first, guys. Open it and then go to the next one. Don't waste any time. And uh, that shouldn't be too hard for real. And maybe you're going to need a second game if you have some competition. But I had an easy lobby that game. So, so yeah, not too bad for real. Next one. That one, believe it or not, is the longest one. Kill 10 enemies in Diner in Battle Royale. If you guys have any tips, let me know. But using the clown class and throwing your zombies and killing your zombies does not count here. Because I tried. Everyone in the chat on stream, they also said it doesn't work. You have to actually kill 10 enemies, guys. So I always went... I, I think it took me three games, okay? 
I land straight at the diner, I loot real quick, get a gun, and then it's the waiting game. You have to wait for bots to spawn and kill bots or some actual enemies to come to you and hopefully you can kill them. But I don't think there's any shortcut here, guys. And a lot of guys confirm in the chat the diner area is actually much bigger than just the diner building. I did stay most of the time on the diner building. Uh, and I got 10 kills in like 3 games. So good luck guys, there's no tips for that one. Just go at diner and stay there for the whole game. I even stayed there when the gas was coming and I even let myself die to the gas. Just hoping maybe I get one more kill before I die. Uh, and then I start another game. And I got lucky once, the, the safe zone stayed around the diner for like 2-3 circles. So yeah, I got like 6 kills in one of my games. Anyways, yeah, go to diner, wait for some kills, and repeat. Just keep going until you get 10. Now, enter the top 10 three times. Well, you're going to have to play some games, guys. A full game is like 15 to 18 minutes. If you know you're in the top 10 and you want to let yourself die to make it faster, just do it. But I played the whole games, and I got them. So, yeah, that could take a while also. Next is the last one. So many questions about that. Run over and kill two enemies while driving a vehicle. Uh, some things work, some things don't work. You have to be actually driving and run and smash the enemies, okay? It's not shooting with the antelope. Uh, it's not shooting with the tank. It's rolling over them and it takes usually more than one hit, guys. You don't one shot uh, enemies by just rolling. So you have to go back and roll over them again. Now the most useful tip ever guys and lots of you guys posted in my comments since last season you can actually do it with the clown class throw your bomb spawn some zombies and kill your own zombies with your vehicles so easy well they're actually moving it's not that easy but like it works so you're not getting shot at you just roll over your zombies and go backwards and roll again and i did it and it works so it's confirmed it's not patch or anything so guys do it solo, bring your zombies, and just find a vehicle and run over them. Alright, so good luck guys. Hope these tips are going to help you get that super cool Ruin Tangled Web skin. I love it for real and super happy I got that. Thank you Cod Mobile for the free skins, they're awesome. So yeah, good luck guys, thanks for watching. Hit the like if you think this video was useful. Don't forget to subscribe for daily vids and I will see you guys in the next one. Take care. Anyways, my zombie bomb's probably charged, so I'm just gonna do it again. But yeah, you just have to... Bruh, they moved! This dude... But good news, my zombies won't die to the bomb now. But I might die to the vehicle explosion. Okay, don't go, don't go, don't go. Why? Okay, that was one. But my vehicle's at 5%. Am I gonna die? Still 5% and I got the second kill. Okay, I got two kills. Let's die. There you go. And I also died to a vehicle explosion. But hey, I got the two zombies. The kills didn't register. How do you know? On, on the top left, it says JC Gaming. Uh, vehicle kill zombie please 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 it does you see that guys it works kill run over and kill two enemies while driving a vehicle in battle royale so someone said it doesn't work it got patched well fake news